Time now for a look at obituaries brought to you by Curtis and Son Funeral Home, the North Chapel on Highway 21 in Sylacauga, and the Childersburg Chapel on Highway 280 in Childersburg. Pre-need funerals, burials, or cremation since, yeah, back in 1975. That's when it all started. The Curtis and Son Funeral Home, 256-245-4361. Pre-need to at-need funeral services, funerals, burials, or cremation. The North Chapel on Highway 21 in Sylacauga and the Childersburg Chapel on Highway 280 in Childersburg. 256-245-4361, pre-need to at-need funeral services. That is Curtis and Son Funeral Home, Sylacauga, Childersburg. Memorial service scheduled this morning for Mr. Robert Walker McMillan. It'll be at 11 o'clock this morning at First Baptist Church of Sylacauga. Visitation from 10 until 11. Curtis and Son Funeral Home, North Chapel, in charge of the arrangements. Mr. Gene Rice Mitchell Frost, age 96. That funeral service will be held. As a matter of fact, it'll be a uh, uh, visitation at 10 a.m. on uh, June the 1st at the North Chapel of Curtis and Son Funeral Home with burial in the Rose Haven Cemetery in Louisville, Kentucky. Curtis and Son Funeral Home, North Chapel in charge of the arrangements. Funeral arrangements to be announced for Catherine Wright, who died on Sunday night at her residence. Curtis and Son Funeral Home, North Chapel in charge of the arrangements. Tammy Smith died on Friday night at Coosa Valley Medical Center at the age of 56. She was from Goodwater, uh, lived in Goodwater. She was here, from, uh, here in Sylacauga. Visitation is going to be tonight, 5 till 8 o'clock at Curtis and Son North. And then the funeral service will be on Wednesday at 2 p.m. from the North Chapel of Curtis and Son Funeral Home with Pastor Walter Wells officiating burial in the Evergreen Cemetery. Curtis and Son Funeral Home, North Chapel, in charge of the arrangements. And Lisa Harmon died in Mississippi at the age of 60 on uh, the 17th of May. And uh, funeral service will be at 11 a.m. on the 24th. It'll be at Curtis and Son Funeral Home, North Chapel, burial in the Evergreen Cemetery. Curtis and Son Funeral Home, North Chapel, in charge of the arrangements. And Mr. John Liverman died at his residence on Saturday at the age of 68. Funeral arrangements to be announced by Curtis and Son Funeral Home. And Carla Wallace died in Sycamore on Thursday. Carla was uh, 61 years old. And uh, the family will make uh, the funeral arrangements later on today at Curtis and Son Funeral Home. These obituaries this morning, courtesy of Curtis and Son Funeral Home, Silicaga. Childersburg.